Hey YouTube, gonna show you guys my Zector deck. Whoa. Okay, camera angle's too low. Um, but first, before I start this deck profile, uh, a couple things I want to mention. Uh, the first thing is congratulations to my friend Casey, who top eight at Columbus Regionals with Prophecies. Awesome prop. And he got eighth place. Uh, his tournament report and a deck profile are on both on uh, Drummer JMM's channel. I'll have a link to that in the description. At the end of the video, but I'm just gonna show you like a screenshot of the deck list that he had, and then because he gave it to me, and then I'm gonna link you to. I'll just tell you just if you want to see the tournament report and how, why he played what he did, um, go check out Drummer Jim's video for that information. So yeah, let's get to this deck profile now. My injectors. I just wanted to make mention that about the that. so three centipede, three ladybug. Uh, the Dragonfly, the Hornet, and the Gigamantis. Staple and Zegger lineup. Uh, then the Tour Guide engine. I run two Tour Guides. Sangin. And the Night Assailant. Uh, one Spirit Reaper. Uh, the reason behind Reaper, I like him as a tech card. Especially because I can set him against Chaos Dragons and Mermail and hold out for quite a long time. Uh, one re uh, one Trooper. <sighs> Sorry. Uh, I was playing two, but I don't like two. That's just because of the fact that I have really, really bad mills with this deck. Like, I have bad mills with any deck. That's why I don't play cards like that. Because it's just my mills. Really, my mills are always bad. Uh, double effect Valor. I feel Valor is a staple, so I have to play. I play two for that reason. So like I have to, or I feel I have to, and then the Dark Arm. So that's staple. Uh, on the spells, uh, two pot of dualities for consistency. Uh, twos of Calibers. I don't like three because if you draw, you don't want to draw them. I, I have the same style of that or same. Concept is I like to search them instead of drawing them. Uh, two MSTs, uh, Book of Moon, Foolish Burial, Mind Control. Um, I like these. Helps me go off. Helps me control the board. This helps me control. These help me control, and this would help me to set up for game. And then you got Dark Hole Reborn, Heavy. Pretty much all the staple spells. And then my last spell is uh, one pot of avarice. I was playing a lord darkness, but I cut the uh, lord of the pot of avarice because if my opponent stops my combos, like they valor me or they like max C or not max C, uh, they then they dark hold me the following turn. I can use this, put all my cards back, and draw two new cards. Like all my combo pieces. <sighs> Excuse me. All my combo pieces are back in my deck, so I can um, redo the combo, and it's just amazing. I love it. I've tested it, and it really, it really works. And then on the traps, uh, I got the Solemn Brigade, the Two Warning Judgment, Staples. You know, judgment stuff is starting to fall out, but still. And then I realized after a while you do have to run this card in three, but three calls the Haunted. Apparently, I found out you do have to. <laughs> um, double bottomless trap hole. It's pretty standard. And then I run three threatening roar. Now, there is no car card in here yet, but I am looking to get some car cardies. I definitely realize I need them for this deck, so with the threatening roars. So I will, if I can get some card card yeast, I will put up a deck profile updating with them, but I don't know if I'll get them or not. Uh, extra deck. Armory arm. Catastor. My two synchros. Never know when I'll make them. Uh, one uh, gachi gachi. Uh, two leviathan dragons. Uh, one giga brilliant. One levier. 
one Zen mains, one Tim Temple, uh, Utopia and Utopia Ray, Adrius, Exostag, Crimson Charlotte Ninja, Tiras. Pretty standard extra deck for Zexers. Um, I don't. I like Exostag more than Zen Mayo. Because the Mayo, you can. Okay, you can destroy two set cards. But I don't like to have to give my own cards up. But, so sometimes they have one set card. I have to set one and I have to go negative one just to make that play. Or I, I have to go for one level. But I have to lose a card in order to do it. And I don't like that. So the Mayo is not my style. Dang it. I don't know why I'm loving so much today, guys. <laughs> uh, side deck, two Raikou. Three Snowman Eater. I love Snowman Eater in the side deck because it's so good. Uh, double Torrential. Uh, double Ghost of Match. Double Dimensional Prison. And then all the one ofs. Uh, one different Dimension Ground. Now, this card is really, really good. It's, it can be used offensively and defensively at the same time. Defensively. When the opponent's playing Dark World or something, they try to go off with a card destruction. You just chain this, and then everything's removed from play. So it's pretty good. Um, it's also good when they go try to go Dark World Dealing. Uh, you, or they try to drag down. Dang it. I'm going to give me a drink after this. <laughs> They're going to try to drag down my hand, and if they have like one card in their hand, I'll just chain the ground. So whatever they... Whatever I pick is banished, which means it's my decision what I was banished. So it's a really good card. It's very good. Uh, one chain disappearance. Uh, this card's fantastic as well in the format because it hits the weak monsters and puts them all out of play. Uh, one max C. And then I'm also setting one death devastation virus. Where are we at? Like okay, we're seven minutes? Okay. So remember, I'll explain this real quick. Um, you would, it's, it's like the best card in the format. You equip any of your inventors with a Gigamantis, or you equip the centipede with a sword, and then you can activate this, and you can really just ruin your opponent's day. Like, they, if you go against like a wind up deck, they lose to this card. Like, they will utterly just lose to it because they'll not, they'll never have monsters in their hand. They'll have to, because their rabbits will be destroyed, their rats will be destroyed, and they'll have no plays to make around this card. It's so good. Alright, so there you go, guys. There's the deck profile. Um, so you have rate, comment, subscribe, and you should be, and now I'm going to bring up the screenshot of Casey's deck list. So, I'll see you guys in another, in another video. Peace. Here's the list.